you can use the Pin tool to lock modeling components in place. Once you pin an object, it cannot be moved until it is unpinned. This can help prevent you from moving objects accidentally, such as mechanical equipment, electrical equipment, and plumbing fixtures. To see this, select the air handling unit. With the equipment selected, on the Modify Mechanical Equipment Contextual Ribbon, in the Modify panel, there is a pin tool. When you click this tool, a push pin icon appears adjacent to the air handling unit. When you click in the drawing area to deselect the element, the push pin icon disappears. But when you select the air handling unit again, you can once again see the push pin. When you deselect the air handling unit, the push pin again disappears. Switch to the Modify ribbon. Click the Pin tool, and then click the Transformer. This time, in the status bar, Revit tells you that you must press Enter or Spacebar to finish. Once you do, you can see that the Transformer has also been pinned. So you can either select the element to be pinned first, or select the Pin tool and then the element. Once an object has been pinned in place, you must first unpin the object before it can be moved, although there are a few exceptions to this rule. A pinned object will still move if it is set to move with nearby elements. The level on which it is placed moves up or down, or it is a hosted element and the host moves. When you start the Move tool and try to move the transformer, Revit displays an error message that cannot be ignored. It simply states that the pinned element cannot be moved. Other than viewing more information about the error, the only option is to click Cancel. To unpin an element, select the pinned object and then either click the push pin in the drawing area or click the unpin button in the modify panel of the ribbon. If you click the push pin in the drawing area, an X appears near the pin control to indicate that it is unlocked. You could then lock it again by clicking the push pin. If you unpin an object using the button in the ribbon, the X does not appear. In that case, to pin the object again, you must click the pin tool in the modify panel of the contextual ribbon. The Modify panel is the best place to unpin multiple objects that have been pinned. To delete a pinned element, you must first unpin it. To see this, select the Pinned Transformer and then click Delete in the Modify panel of the contextual ribbon. When you do, the Transformer is highlighted and a warning appears. The warning simply states that pinned objects were not deleted and that they must be unpinned before they can be deleted. However, you can click Expand Warning Dialog and then drill down in the warning to see the specific elements that are pinned. You can then check any or all of the elements that may appear and click Delete Checked to delete those elements without unpinning them first. 